<laughs> Season 2, episode 53. We're back, we're back, we're back. It seems like it's been so long since I've done one of these things. All right, Zelda. <laughs> you crack me up. You ever hear the saying, beauty is only skin deep? Well, pardon oh. me if I hadn't noticed. You don't want to spoil the surprise. And it's a good one. That was creepy. So it could have been just another easy dub for Vegeta, but they have done so. I introduce you to the beast. Oh man! A dam? A dam. We have three different suns, so there's always at least one out in the sky. So you're saying on your planet you never have night? Alright, who had battle told Zelda? I didn't see that coming. Pull it together, Vegeta! Alright, looking pretty good. He's getting there. Oh, okay. Well... If I can keep going at this rate, I think I should definitely be ready for Vegeta. You can't win! The best thing you can do is to stay away from him altogether! That's it! I have to train harder! <laughs> They're still on the monkey? They haven't even made it to the... Was it Grasshopper or something? Jesus Christ. No! I won't lose! That's intense. I was just about to say, oh man. Close line. Oh no. Alright, Vegeta, you might have to ape guy. Ape beats turtle. Not turtle. <laughs> Frog. <laughs> Quality looking fight. I like how it was just like a brutish and aggressive. Wasn't the water just blue? The nice music. How did I ever get into this mess? I just hope Krillin and Dende are still doing okay. The power levels dropped, but I'm sure it's not good for us either way. Let's keep moving. Actually, I think it's a little bit to the left. It's just up ahead on top of that bluff. Actually, I guess it'd be pretty hard to miss, huh? Looks like we made it. <laughs> Looks like we made it. I like how suspicious K9 is. It's so quiet. Maybe they got him all. You didn't look that old. It's good to see you again, Dende. So, then Guru knows about everything that's been going on? I will take both of you to Guru now. He's too weak to move. His power level's a lot higher than the others. Master, I've brought Dende and his friend from Earth. Is there something I can do to repay your kindness? Oh, well, uh... <laughs> He's hungry! Prospects are not great that you'll beat both of them. Push himself to still greater heights if he hopes to overcome the challenges ahead. There it is. So we've got a hurdle, a hurdle for Vegeta, who seemed like he was just going to, you know, run circles around all of his enemies on planet Namek. But Zelda had some tricks, some Battletoads tricks, and now Vegeta has to convalesce before he can, he can, uh, challenge again. Good fight. I like it. I like that it had its own kind of character in the way that it progressed. And we had K9 looking for the Elder One, and we'll see where this goes. And Bulma doing a whole lot of nothing. I don't think Gohan actually said anything this whole episode. I kind of liked it better when you had the boys doing their thing. He should have just gone with K9 more, and they should have both been doing this whole deal. But I'm guessing later something's going to come up with Gohan that he's going to have to do. But anyway, storytelling wise, you do have uh, this twist here with Vegeta taking an L, and you got to figure out how this, uh, you know, Elder Namek fits into the grander scheme of things and then they'll reincorporate the big baddie Frieza and we'll get to move on from that so uh, yeah a lot of moving parts right now in Dragon Ball Z